Hi to everyone from my home country, Azerbaijan. I am playing World Cup this year in Baku. I'm excited and playing at home also has some pressure on me. I'm trying to show my best performance. Uh, however, World Cup is like a, a little bit like a lottery. If you are lucky, you will play well. If you are not lucky, <laughs> soon may, you may go home. Often, I mean, in, in this case, it doesn't matter. I am at home <laughs> either by winning or by losing. Eh, this is a knockout system, obviously. And we have two classical games. And if the, the games end a the draw, then we are playing uh, rapid games, etc. So today I played my first game against um, Figurado Lozada Leonel. I mean, I've never um, heard about him before our match. And um, yeah, he came with a surprise. Actually, it is interesting, you know, when I when the favorite plays uh, against underdog, you know, it is expected that I, you know, favorite will win easily. Uh, but it is not that simple, especially in a very short match. And today's game, actually, maybe I was close to lose. Let's go over the game and see what happened. So my opponent played e4, c5. Knight f3, d6, d4, c, d, knight d4, knight f6, knight c3, a6. I decided to play knight of, uh, which is a sharp sharp opening. I thought, I mean, because of uh, my opponent's rating, I thought that I could take some risk. I mean, it's a risky variation, but I was like, okay, this is the first game. If something bad happens, I will still have a chance in the next game. So my opponent plays queen d3, which I did not expect. And I was wondering what he prepared. And I decided to play, um, like, basically rouser. I play bishop d7, bishop g5, knight c6. Knight c6, bishop c6, long castle. Uh, we transpose basically from, um, from knight to to uh, Rouser, if I play here e6, it is, ex I mean, not exactly, usually queen is supposed to be on d2, but sometimes queen can be on d3. Maybe I should have played e6, actually, now I am thinking. Uh, nevertheless, I played queen a5. I felt like forcing his bishop to go to d2 will work in my favor. I wanted uh, here to play g6 and develop my bishop through g7. However, there is a, this problem, king b1. Let's say if I play queen c7, he has this knight d5, bishop d5, ed, bishop g7, bishop c3. I thought this position is better for white, and engine agrees with me. So I played e6, king b1, and queen c7. Uh, actually, I did kind of evaluate it correctly. Position is already equal. Uh, however, it seems like bishop d2 might have been inaccurate. He should have played either f4 or h4. f4 probably e6. Would transpose to some lines anyways so e6 queen c7 i was playing fine um rook d8 and queen e3 bishop e7 bishop d3 here i think i got over ambitious uh which was my mistake i immediately wanted to play obviously here b move b5 with the idea to push b4 also create a square for my queen but what I didn't like that he plays e5, d, e, bishop e5, queen b7, and f3. Actually, f3 engine doesn't really like. Engine says this position is better for, for me. So he shouldn't play that. He should take on f6 and play bishop e4. Um, actually, I, I, I mean, if I knew that he, he would take f6, I would have gone probably for this position. Because my bishop is active, maybe there will be some attack to the king. All the angel says it is just equal. You play rook c8, rook d6. I mean, uh, maybe maybe it was time to make draw or something. But I I, I wanted to uh, push a little bit further, so I played knight d7. Here also I was thinking about move e5, bishop g5, knight g4. It was a cute tactic. Unfortunately, it did not uh, work very well. I was I was hoping for this this idea that I take knight d1. Oh, I didn't actually see knight d5 move. Wow, 
Oh, game over. <laughs> bishop d5 because now he has bishop d8. My idea was that if he takes bishop d8, I have knight c3 and a wonderful position. Uh, but I missed that. Um, he has intermediate move, this one. Luckily, I didn't play. I played knight d7. I stopped e5 idea. Uh, uh, but the problem is that... Why, playing with white is simple. He went for g3, castle, and pushed h4. He wants to go h5, bishop h6, and then sacrifice or something like that. And I needed to find here in the move king h8, h5, and h6. This doesn't look like uh, so simple because after queen e3, it looks like he's about to sacrifice on h6 and there is some devastating attack. Nevertheless, engine says there is nothing I shouldn't have worried at all um to be frank i as soon as i played knight e5 i thought that maybe i should have done this h6 idea anyways i played a knight e5 h5 bishop f6 h6 g6 and bishop g5 uh, here i blundered uh, my opponent's move bishop e2 although angel says anyway position is much worse for you and at this point, I did understand that my position is not good anymore and I needed to find some way to equalize the game. I mean, there is no easy way, but I think I played the best practical move, d5. Uh, my opponent, uh, she should have probably taken ed first. And I initially, my idea was to take ed, but then I didn't like this rook d4 move. Therefore, I might have played bishop d5. Angel says white's advantage is huge. But my opponent played f4. f4. And against f4, I was gonna play knight c4. Then I changed my mind because what I didn't like that there is e5, queen e7, and bishop c4, d c4. I didn't like this position. I thought that uh, in many cases, after trading the queen, knight is stronger than bishop. Therefore, I played d4. Fe, queen e7. Oh, oh, I didn't see this strong move d3. dc, rook d6. Wow, it's a, it was a nice one, but not easy to recognize. So my opponent played a, a slightly worse move. Queen dc, bc. And here... Oh, I made a mistake. Yeah, initially I was thinking about taking, taking and playing rook c8. And I thought this position um, better for white. Then I got... I, I mean, I, I really like this f5 move. I, I didn't want to um, stay passively and defend, so I went for f5. Apparently this move just um, might have been... I mean, I might have might have lost if my opponent played accurately here he should have taken d8 queen d8 and then he takes and then bishop c4 oh i did see this idea but i thought that i have because i have queen b6 check and take e4 i should be fine but the engine says no after queen g5 you are just lost your king is very weak and your pieces are not well coordinated Anyway, he takes EF, queen f6, and makes uh, another mistake. Queen takes f6, gives equality. He should have played queen g4. Keep eye on e6. A queen f6, rook d1, rook d1, rook f6. And the angel says that I almost equalized here, but my big mistake comes. And actually, as soon as I played, I realized that I should have played rook f2 here. If bishop c4, then I take... Uh, g2 or e4 even bishop e4 rook e6 bishop c2 king uh, somewhere c1 king f8 and this should be draw uh, but then i changed my mind i decided to take e4 i underestimated how strong um his position would be after this uh, few moves now my ca king is trapped cannot get activated and this pawn is like alpha zero spawn is doing very important task and I cannot really get active. Luckily, my opponent uh, was low on time and he made a few mistakes in a row. Rookie seven is a very bad move. 
it's not easy to notice uh, but now after i show my moves you will understand why it is bad so rookie seven i can play b5 bishop b3 and the strong move bishop e1 and my idea is to play bishop c4 the trade the bishop and push the pawn so here he was he, he went for a6 pawn bishop c4 g5 i started pushing the pawn and he cannot do a4 because g4 a b i can play g3 and it's already winning for black i'm promoting so he went for bishop c4 bc rook e6 g4 rook e3 and here basically um, forcing line here i i offer draw he agreed because he takes g4 rook h6 rook takes c4 right? and actually even if i I know I'm not sure that if I didn't have h pawn it's draw but if I can put my king in front of his pawn even uh, white uh, white 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 two pawns is not enough for win it's a theoretical draw but my king should be on c7 anyway I have h7 I'm gonna sacrifice and get that position so he, he even didn't try and we ended up with draw and so with that I can end my first recap of the tournament, uh, exciting game, I think I might have slightly over pushed and could have gotten punished, luckily it didn't happen and I got my draw, tomorrow I am playing with white against the same opponent, hopefully I will be able to show better performance, see you tomorrow, take care.